Hi Capricorn, how are you? Welcome to your weekly reading for July the 10th to July the 12th, July the 16th of 2016. I am Renee Michelle and this is my channel here on YouTube, Chronicles of a Hoodoo Spiritualist. I want to thank you guys for the likes, the shares, and the comments. Thank you so much. And I also want to welcome all the new subscribers. Welcome to the family. Welcome to the club. Thank you guys so much for the love and support that you gave me during this week. I love you and thank you so very, very much. Um, it was the Save My Life special, but I'm changing it when I upload these video videos to the gratitude special because I'm really grateful and thankful for what you guys have done for me. <sighs> HoodooSpiritualist.net if you want to book a reading. Information is down below. So coming into this week, you want to walk away from something, right? You're looking dead at it. You're making a judgment. Man, there's something going on here, and it's strengthening you. It's like you're walking away from something you put your time, effort, and energy towards, right? And you and it, it, you got to see how the cards are out. Oh God, I think I'm going to, Aquarius, you're about to get, I mean, um, Capricorn, you're about to get the, the, the floor reading because I want to see how, show you how these cards are laid, right? Look at here. You're looking towards letting go of something that you put your time, effort, and energy towards, right? You're making a judgment decision about it, right? So this is all in one direction. You're looking here. And here, strength has got your back because as you make these decisions to get rid of these people, you grow in strength, right? At the beginning of the month, I mean the week, right? You're emotional about a past situation or past relationship. You're emotional because it's like you 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 know you know it's over, but it's like you keep going back and looking back. Yeah? This is supposed to be like this. You keep looking back. At the middle of the week, you feel victorious, right? Because there's somebody that was trying to get to you and you blocked that. You would not let it happen. Right? And that makes you feel good about you. By the end of the week, right, you you come to the early decision, you know, in your mind, you had this aha moment that you want a perfect marriage, happy love relationship. Right? It's just this light that pops on at the end of the week and you're like, whoa, I really do need this. this you know, I need this in my world, but in a good way, in the right way. Right? You're moving forward with strong and serious force. Right? But then over here it says that you're in limbo about something. So I feel like you're in limbo about starting new relationships based on what has been going on. Um... And you're avoiding, uh, you're avoiding a love offering. There's somebody chasing you, right? And you're like, oh, hell to the norm, right? <laughs> you're like, I don't want to, right? But to both of you are jacks, which tells me that you're both acting a little immature for your age, yeah? Capricorn just wants to be seen for who they are. They don't have time for any other BS. They want to shine in the light. They want to move on and do their own thing. And you also want to save money. That's also going on beneath the surface. Okay, Capricorn. Love you. Stay blessed. Enjoy your week. Ashe and peace.